the Q side. Hey, it's Caduce and welcome to the Q side. Last edition, we got you our West Coast time out of Rock the Bells. This time it's for our East Coast heads. And of course, it's only right we bring it to you from New York City. For anybody that grew up listening to hip hop in the golden era, these guys are legendary. Sean Price from Boot Camp Click and Prodigy of Mob Deep. And their tour stories are even more legendary. Tell me your favorite tour memory. We was in Chile and somebody, um, um, somebody snatched Rock Hat and I put him to sleep. And it, it wasn't really in like nap time, it was more It like, wasn't no, no. Right? Actually it wasn't, no punches thrown. Oh word. I didn't punch him. I'm how did, dead how did it go down? You know, I, you know, I'm well trained. So whatever was applied to him, you know, he laid. The, I laid them down. And Rock, nevertheless, Rock got his hat back. It was so hold on, like how that. did you get your hat taken though? Like, how, how did that just happen? Just a, a fan, just a wild fan. Just ran and just, just snatched it off your head. And we didn't let him keep it, but you know, sometimes we got those nice classic hats that's hard to find. So it was like a Darth Vader technique? I, I, you know, I'm I, I could do two things pretty good, rap and fight. Like he walked right into it. It was like good night. Like it was, yeah. Like a ninja tactic to the yeah, it was, it was almost Vulcan death. You know what I mean? Like <laughs> death grip. Yeah. Do you have any particular tour memories that come to mind? Crazy tour memories, man. I remember we was on tour on the Massacre tour with Fifty, and um, it was this girl that followed. Followed the the, uh, the tour. Like we didn't know. We were trying to figure out how the fuck is she getting to every state. Like she's at every state we go to. We Clearly doesn't have a job. At the at the hotel in the parking lot, walking around looking for niggas and shit. She had like six, seven different states. She's like, how's this bitch getting here? Somebody's paying for this bitch to come every show. But we see the bitch late one night, yo. We coming from like Waffle House or some crazy shit. We we and we walking through the parking lot and it's dark as hell and. We see this bitch coming out the woods, looking like a possum, you heard? She came, <laughs> she came out the woods like a big, big rat. We like, yo, what the f this scared the shit out of us, yo. Me and Twin like, yo, and 40, 40 was with me. We like, yo, where this bitch come from out the woods, yo? It was just like two in the morning. We like, what the f this bitch is doing out there? So the bitch came, she trying to talk to us. She like, yo, where's 50 at? 50 said he gonna take me to Candyland. I said, yo, this bitch is crazy, yo. <laughs> So the bitch starts showing us her tattoos. She had G-Unit tattooed on her, Mob Deep, Lloyd Banks, Tony Yayo, 50 Cent, all over her body she had tattoos, yo. Oh, man. Yo, we was bugging off of that shit. I was like, yo, this bitch is crazy. Get this bitch out of here. We found out the tour bus driver was f bitch. Like, I mean, you can't knock the nigga hustle, you know what I'm saying? He, he truck driver trying to get off. That's it. He's doing pretty well for truck driver. I will not be taking that gentleman's hat anytime soon. You never know. The Vulcan grip might come out. And I will also not be letting any kind of possum-like girls up onto the queue side. Of, don't you worry. And this is a fresh experience of entertainment. This is when you feel like I'm actually living my dream. Yes. You are interested in DTF. I don't know what DTF is. You're interested. I'm gonna get that habit because it doesn't hit you fidget and I'm switching my position to my buddies on my left butt cheek. Piss because the number stupid phone is gonna ring again. I wanna.